I mentioned constitutional recognition in my, in my maiden speech to this place, and it's something very important to me. And I think one of the frustrations I've found is that a lot of people have come to a position on this before um, the, the, the wording was actually decided. Uh, this is a very, very minimal change. This is basically closing the loophole uh, uh, to enable uh, the funding processes uh, that are already in place to continue. This is, uh, uh, in, in some ways, as part of me uh, as a former local government mayor, wishing that this, uh, this uh, referendum was asking for more. But in fact it's not. It's only asking to, uh, to close up uh, the loopholes uh, and so that um, uh, issues uh, such as roads to recovery uh, and, uh, and, and some of the regional programs can continue. As a regional member, uh, I, I think the, uh, the words of Professor Toomey, who was actually speaking against this referendum, uh, saying that it was going to uh, favour regional local government areas, uh, that was enough reason for me uh, to want to support it. And the committee uh, set up by the government to look at the possibility of a referendum to the constitutional recognition of local government uh, is coming to the final stages of its deliberation. There will be a hearing in Sydney next week and, um, and final recommendations will be made to the government from that. At the moment, uh, the government does seem to be keen to press ahead uh, with this referendum regardless uh, of the support on the ground. Personally, uh, I think with, uh, it's possible uh, for a referendum to be successful. Uh, certainly, um, if the government decides to go ahead, uh, I'll be uh, doing everything in my power to encourage uh, the, uh, the states and, uh, and local government representatives to get behind this uh, and make this happen. Uh, unfortunately, uh, during the 10 or 11 months since the uh, uh, original committee made recommendations uh, with regards to constitutional recognition uh, and a uh, format of the wording change to the constitution uh, were agreed to, uh, there's been very little activity from Minister Crean. I've spoken to Minister Crean last week uh, uh, suggesting that he uh, once again contacts the state governments to, uh, to gain their support.